Hey guys, what's up? It's me. Um, kind of weird, because I'm on camera for once, which is kind of crazy, because I don't do this very often, but I've got some really big news to tell you guys, and it's quite cool news. Um, so, as of like the end of last week, I officially launched my own website. So I now have my own website, it's called um, mjpakmat.co.uk I will put a link on screen and a link to it down below. I've got a website which is really really cool. <laughs> I've been wanting to do this for like over a year and I thought, okay I'm getting donations on stream, I'm comfortable in my job, blah 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 blah, I can afford to host it and build it and stuff. So I've spent the last six, seven, maybe eight weeks building this website in my spare time mostly while watching streams so when I'm sort of sitting down late at night watching a stream I'm watching a stream on one screen building the website on the other and then it's basically having fun doing it and it's finally finished and live which is so cool um, one of the reasons I did it was so that I could have one central place where all of my stuff is sort of together and you can guys can go there and you can see it and you're like Matt's doing this oh Matt does this that's cool and it's all in one place. So on the website, I'll put some like screen recordings on the screen now. But on the website, we've got the homepage, which is kind of like a live feed from like my my um, Instagram and my Twitter and stuff like that. And then we have the content online content page, which has like YouTube stuff and Twitch stuff. It's a bit about why I do Twitch and why I do YouTube. And then we have the online art gallery page as well. So this page basically is a long big gallery of different types of artwork I've done over the last sort of year, year and a half. There's a few little older bits in there as well. And I might add, but I will be adding more to that page as well. So as I do more artwork and more design stuff, I'll be adding to it and updating it and stuff like that. So that'd be fun to look at and see. I have not, I've got stuff I'm working on now, but I don't know if I'm going to upload it or not. Um, the other update thing to talk about is the merch. So if you guys know, down below in my videos and the links, there is a link to a Spreadshirt store, which is where I have merch t-shirts and stuff. Now, I'm going to leave that store open, because no point closing it down. I'm going to leave it open and I'm going to move my priority of posting my merch to my Redbubble store which I recently opened and updated so yeah um, I have a Redbubble uh, I have a Redbubble store called MJP Designs and the reason I called it that is very simple is I don't just do merch on that store so when I come up with an idea for like a cool t-shirt I design it and upload it to there and it's in one place for you guys to get everything together or to get everything together in one place so there's a section for um, just merch in terms of like MJP merch then there's sort of merch specific to things that happen on the stream so it was like a DJ Dave t-shirt for those of you who don't know who DJ Dave is he's my um, DJ monkey who does all the DJing on my stream um, it's kind of a bit of a joke so he's got his own t-shirt and stuff there's a few more DJ Dave t-shirts and merch stuff that I'm working on currently so you guys can uh, possibly look forward to that it's really cool um, but other than that, I've been really busy at work and making videos. So when I'm not at work, I'm either streaming or making videos at the moment, which is really good. I recently got, I recently got Twitch affiliate, so I'm going to set that up late tonight, hopefully. Um, and try and stick to that, because that's really cool that I got Twitch affiliate. And it means I can get a subscribe button and stuff like that. So that's really, really good. Um, proud of myself for doing that. It's been a long time. But I'm getting into a schedule of streaming now. So every day I'm off work, I stream for three or four hours a day, which is great. I wake up, do a stream. Then I spend my afternoon and evening um, recording, editing videos and uploading them. So that's great fun. Um, but yeah, the last big thing to talk about is I will be at Insomnia next week. So today is Tuesday. And I can't what date, what is the date of insomnia? What is the date of insomnia? I can't remember. Well, let me just find out. Because, um, I've completely forgotten. My brain's gone dead. Oh no, my brain's dead. 
it is the 29th to the 2nd of March or April. So it runs from Friday the 30th to the 2nd day of April. I will be there from Thursday night onwards. I'm there for the entire event. I've been looking forward to this event for six months. Flip. It's been a long time. I get to hang out with my friends, drink lots of beer and have fun and play some games. Look at all the new games and computer parts. It's going to be a good weekend. It's going to be a real good weekend. I can't wait to go. But, having said that, if you guys are going and you want to come say hi and you see me walking around, please do. Could it be cool? It's only happened like once or twice before, but if you guys come again, that'd be great. I love meeting some of you guys. It's nice to get feedback as well in person from things that I'm doing on the channel. So like when you sort of speak to me about it, it's like, oh, what are you doing to do with this? Or you're doing with this project, whatever it is. It's nice to see people's reactions to what I'm doing and then sort of gauge whether I'm going the right way or the wrong direction or whatever it may be. So that's quite fun. Um, other than that, there's not much really happening. At the moment, we've got Lara Croft anniversary, or two minute anniversary it's called, on the channel. We're getting close to finishing Simpsons Hit and Run. I don't know what game I might do after that. I do like doing the older retro games, so I might try and get, say, a Crash Bandicoot emulator for the original Crash Bandicoot from PS1. I've also was thinking about doing the Hugo games on PlayStation 1 as well. The Hugo games are really good. Um, Hugo was the game that I played most on PS1. Yeah, that and Crash Bash. That was the two games I played most of. Um, Crash Bash was like the multiplayer Crash Bandicoot game, and it was epic. It was absolutely epic, and... I can't wait to play that again, if I can get the chance to get an emulator on the computer for it. Uh, so yeah guys, that's, it's been a cool time. We've also got Matt's Palace, which is going really well. Um, I've got some really good things sort of planned in my head right now for it. I'm going to sort of plan them out properly tonight as well. Um, we're going to do lots of stuff in Mo Creatures soon. We're going to be hopefully building a city and an empire for the palace, to sit, sit around the palace. Working on some gardens for the palace as well, getting some more pets. Um, I've got a pet tortoise called Timmy on the um, what Minecraft world as well. But he's called a turtle, which doesn't make sense, because a turtle lives in water and a tortoise lives on land. So I don't know why Minecraft has called it a turtle, because it's not a turtle. It's kind of a weird thing to do, but it's Minecraft, so what do you expect? Everything's square and blocky. That's that. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Um, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Definitely go check out the website down below or on screen now.